So this is your 1999 model NL Pajero. The three and a half litre V6 narrow body, as you'll note by the lack of big flares. Basically bog standard for the era and knocked up into a bit of a camping rig for me um, in the last couple of years on the cheap, as you would. So your old $100 gum tree bumper there, bull bar I suppose. And you've stolen the uh, UHF off a mate, obviously. <laughs> light bar I bought when I had money, I no longer do. So the light bar's better than the car, arguably. <laughs> Fully stock wheels and tyres. Whoa. No sign of any rust, don't worry about that. <laughs> I would say. The centre caps are shining because I shined them two days ago. They are, they're very shiny. They're, shiny they're beautiful. The the you got roof racks on it, mate. Roof racks came with it, that's true. And what's in the back? Pretty ordinary. Uh, Show us in the back. Pretty ordinary awning you can uh, put on those roof racks that came with the car. What have you, what's the setup here? So real basic budget camp setup essentially, just a bit of plywood to split the uh, area in half. Another 50 bucks on Gumtree was that little drawer. And then yeah, some ply on the top. Turn it into a bit of a flat space, put a uh, cheap sponge mattress on top and you know, Robert's your father's brother really. And that fits a six foot three guy. It does indeed. In the back, what's in the drawer? That's the job. Crack open the drawer, mate. I can crack open the drawer. What, uh, what goodies have you got? Well, there's actually a nice new knife, which is soon to be a Christmas present. <laughs> <laughs> Various recovery gear and first aid and bits yeah. and pieces. I put that little thing together as a bit of a table I can use while I'm in there. Nice. Does the nice. job. But essentially just the old no budget camping setup is the, uh, is the scenario. Nothing wrong with that, mate. And engine, V6, 3.5 litre. The three and a half litre, 6G70. Mm. 6G74, yeah. The commenters may correct me on that one, but something like that. Not a tower of power, but it's, it certainly gets it along. It's tidy. It's been reliable, right, for you? It absolutely hasn't skipped a beat. Since yeah. Yep. Happy days. And I'm fortunate to have bought one with relatively low Ks at the time. And it came no from it came from a guy, uh, like the original owner was Queensland Gov or New what? South Wales Gov. It's kind of slightly interesting. It was bought Queensland a, Gov, um, yeah. as a model that was modified to run in uh, the Queensland Government Department of Agriculture and Fisheries as a beetle patrol vehicle. Would you believe? <laughs> okay. Beetle patrol vehicle used to assess insect populations in national forests in Queensland, Australia. Okay. 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 Back in '99. Much cooler car than Queensland government would buy today, I'll tell you right. <laughs> what did you find in the back of it rolling around, Ruben? Yeah, I can report there were many loose bullets kicking around in it when I bought it. So previously was, uh, I guess the second owner after the Queensland government was a gentleman keen on hunting. Because yes, it was full of bullets when I bought it. So there you go. Happy days. But as a good old truck, 1990s. How many Ks did you say it had on it? 150. Mm, that's low. That's low for that year, that's 1990s. Time, not bad at all. Yeah. Yeah. She's a good old girl. Um, interior wise, it's got it's got the the level a meter or something in it, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can have a look on the middle there. I'm gonna turn the. Uh, Oh, Let me your lights on for you. Hold on a second, I'll enhance. Lit. Lit up. Got the inclinometer there. Inclinometer, that's yeah, the word I was looking for. That's the word you're after. Yeah. Dash. It's getting a little bit dark. Mitsubishi doesn't care if you drain your battery by leaving your lights on. No need for an <laughs> well, warning well, alarm there. Well, there's no dingers. It's no. not annoying the hell out of you going bing bong, bing bong. They're not bothered. No. 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 Oh, cool vehicle. How many trips have you done in it now? 
Yeah, it has to be half a dozen. Now. Half a dozen troops. Good solid. I don't know, eight, ten thousand k's since I bought it. And it gets driven like an all-wheel drive Audi. Yeah, it does the job. Doesn't it? <laughs> Corners, smooth as. It's been through the high country in Australia. It's been through the snow. It hasn't yeah. had a problem. Yeah. yeah. Good machine. Mm. There you go. That's Ruben's Mitsubishi Pajero. Yeah.